If you're following Johnny and Amber and things around them, I'm sure you know one of the incidences with Amber was that she took two dogs into Australia and she committed perjury. Now, the Australian government came out and said they're not going to go further with the case. They're not pressing charges or whatever you call it. They're just not going to give her a punishment. One important note is they are not saying she's innocent. I'm sure a lot of Amber fans may twist this around and say Australia said she didn't do it. It wasn't true, this and that. But it's not a declaration of innocence what the government put out there. They're just saying they're not going to pursue it for certain reasons. I'm not surprised. Some people were. I guess some people were waiting for that day when it comes. And since they knew about it, they had to do something. But no, it's not really how this world works. I'm surprised they even made a statement. But anyway, this is from People, and the reason I want to cover this is because People has been very positive about Amber, so I want to see how they describe the situation. Amber Heard will not be charged with perjury as new case over improper import of two dogs into Australia dropped. So, okay, good on them for saying she won't be charged with it meaning she did it, but she won't be charged. I mean, she pleaded guilty to it, so there is that. Anyway, from August 23rd, 2023, pretty new. Let's see what we got. They start with some details about 2015. They phrase it as this. Aquaman actress will not be charged in relation to allegations that she lied about details of her two Yorkshire Terriers while brought into Australia, but wait a minute. Those were allegations that she lied? I thought she lied. She admitted it, but okay. Kind of confusing, just for me. I'm no lawyer. And they say this in the bottom. Little piece of history. This led to her 37 appearing in Southport Magistrates Court in Australia in 2016 and pleading guilty to providing a false immigration document. Heard was sentenced to a one-month good behavior bond while the charges of illegally importing the dogs to Australia were dropped per ABC News. So the importation was dropped at that time. I wasn't aware of that little detail. They say Heard's lawyer denied that she had intended to lie, but when Virginia came around, Kevin Murphy said that Amber knew all along. I mean, if she did it, she did it. Whether she knew or not is a separate issue, but committing the act is actually the crime. And once again, they say prosecution action will not be taking place against actress Amber Heard. And this part down here seems like a bit of a defense. They say Amber wasn't quite sure about the biosecurity laws in Australia. It's somewhat believable. I mean, if you asked like a thousand people in the street right now at random who are like 26, 27 or something, they might not know. But... I've known for a long time. I've known since I was in like junior high school. I'll tell you why. Bart Simpson and the Simpsons, before they left Australia in a very early episode, I'm talking, you know, first couple of seasons, dropped a frog or something or a lizard in Australia and it ruined the ecosystem. So from there on in, I knew about it. But okay, I mean, it's not unbelievable. But then again... A quick Google search clears that up or even asking like one of your parents or anybody like, you know, should I be doing this? Taking these dogs on an international flight would clear it up. So even if she didn't know, it's pretty easy to find out and double check. They basically say again, they made a decision not to prosecute. So they say over and over, we're deciding not to prosecute. We're deciding not to prosecute. Okay, fine. Let's hear more about the why you aren't. They mentioned the video apology, which I used to use here on the channel. This used to come up a lot more, but I think it's lost at this point. Anyway, for people, it wasn't their worst. They got most of the facts right. I didn't see too many slippery defenses and things like that. A few things here and there, but otherwise, yeah, not bad for them. Anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. Doing shout outs, special thanks. Things like that. If you don't subscribe here, I'll be real sad about it, but I'll get over it. See you next time.